hi everyone welcome back to bookio tv kindly subscribe to our youtube channel and turn the bell notification on so anytime we upload new video onto youtube you will be notified thank you I received was from a friend of his asking when last I heard from him. Okay. And I, I called I called his name because immediately I called his name but it wasn't me. I called his name. She was already crying at the back. And when I called his sister later, <laughs> That they should check the face of the person who to the hospital. But when I saw the video later, I realized that it was actually Kelo. Kelo, Kelo doesn't like stress. He's a very peaceful person. He doesn't like trouble at all. He avoids it. He stays away from trouble. But SARS cut his life short. This is what is left. Kelo! This is all that is left of Kelo! His phone is covered in blood. That's the only thing left of Kelo. I just want justice to be served because enough is enough. Today is me, tomorrow it might be you. I've been seeing answers on the internet. I always retweet and everything. I never knew it to hit me directly like this. We want justice because we know the police will certainly cover the whole issue. Up. They, will, they will try to cover up the case. Please, we want we want justice. We don't want them anymore. If they cannot go after the armed robbers with if they cannot go after armed robbers or they cannot go after people with order, you know, you need an order before you can arrest, arrest someone. Warrant. Arrest, warrant. arrest warrant. Thank you. That's what, if they cannot do that, then they should, we don't want them anymore because they become a menace. Just barely an hour ago, while we're still uh, mourning and everything, they said SARS officials passed with another dead body. That's another family mourning somewhere. I'm sure you guys will have to go there to interview them again because the body was lifeless on the van and the van passed through here. So they've killed Kelo. Kelo has a son. The son is very ill. It's not my it's not my child. But he has a son. And the boy is very ill. Kelo was just running up and down to see that he could raise money for the boy. But they've left the boy without the father. That's Nigeria today. When was the last time you spoke to him? What was the last thing you said? What was the last conversation you had? Well, it's quite complicated and quite personal. But the last thing he said to me on the text, yes, he said he will always love me. That was what he said to me. I have it in my chat. He sent it to his friend. He said, I can't move on without this girl. That was what he said to me. He's on chat. Thank you so much for watching Bookie O TV. Do not forget to comment below, share this video, and click on that subscribe button. And remember to tap the notification bell so you will be notified anytime we upload a new video onto YouTube. Until I come your way again, stay beautifully blessed.